What's happening, fam? LAR Movement Still Moving. Book is entitled Lessons from a Non Custodial Father at Amazon Kindle and Create Space. Link will be in the description box below as usual. Go get it. PayPal link there also. They asked me to put it up, so I'll put it up. Thanks everybody for supporting. But this video, though, this video is entitled Is Feminism Equal to Interracial Dating? Hey, I like doing these type of videos. Now, Feminism as an ideology says women are a sisterhood, collective. And it's for the sisters, right? So if you are woman first and black second, or you in in some ideas you take on feminist ideologies, whether you do it consciously, maybe even subconsciously, overtly or covertly. We as men, we know. Uh but if you're a sister and you are a feminist and you take on feminist ideology and you're a woman first, and that means you, you congregate with women of other groups before you congregate with the men in your own group. So if that's the case, and women are first and men come second, is it the same as when a man decides, you know, let me date non-black women. You know, may, maybe they come first and, you know, sisters may be second. Or dated sisters first and then chose a woman outside of that that's in the sisterhood. And then you get backlash. Because, see, there's no backlash for feminism per se. You know, nobody's saying you're taking on non-black women's talking points. You're taking non-black women's ideologies and you're running with them. They don't even, you know, even feminists who are white are still like white men. And they're a sisterhood. They don't, they, they're not open to, they're not saying, oh, we're, you know, they're not telling you to, you can date white men. They're saying, be our sister. Be a woman first, but we're going to date our men. So, but you're saying, some of you sisters are out here saying, I'm a woman first. But men are evil, so I'm not messing with my men, but I will choose a white guy. I And the reason I got to ask this, because it intrigues me, because I've, I maybe I'm wrong. I haven't seen white women pushing for black women to get with white men. I haven't seen Hispanic women pushing for black women to get with Hispanic men. I haven't seen Asian women pushing for black women to get with Asian men. Even if they have a feminist ideology, they still gravitate to the men in their group. But the sisterhood is so strong, so tight. But if you could listen to women of other groups, and you could be seen in pictures you know, clicked up, showing solidarity, then why can't the guys be clicked up with uh, those same other groups of women clicked up in solidarity? And you'd be like, what, what do you, that's different. Technically it's not because feminism is also rooted in lesbianism. That's why people always make the reference that, you know, feminists are normally lesbians. So, to a degree, we got to say that some of y'all, of all races, y'all dating each other. So if y'all dating each other, because you don't really see the backlash with feminist interracial dating each other. You know, is it, is it, is it, a, is it considered interracial dating when it's two lesbians doing it? Not really, because it's a lesbian thing. It's a woman thing. It's not a racial thing. So feminists could do it, but heterosexual men can't do it. So, but in practice, they're doing the very same thing. But, you, but those people aren't producing kids. You're right. They're just... Looking for love. So, if these guys 
are looking for love, they happen to be heterosexual and a woman happens to be heterosexual, a kid might wind up getting, might happen. That's just biological. Two women can't produce a kid, a man and a woman can. But if you dating like that, you know, if you're a feminist, how is it different from interracial dating? Because you're saying, you know, technically, you know, women are better than men. Just like the same complaint is, when, if you say, you hear guys say, these women are better than these women. You already said one gender, one gender is superior to the other, so you are, you, you are in the in interest of that gender. So, if, if these guys say, these women are closer to um, the feminine, the femininity that I'm looking for, and it's not you. I mean, it's pretty much the same thing, but it's not looked at that way. And I got to ask the questions, though. Why not? See, and the reason I'm, I'm asking this question is for this reason. Feminism has the ideology that you know, women can do anything a man can do. So when it comes to protecting, providing, building, maintaining, they say women can do that too. So if you could do all these things that a man could do, and why are you mad if a man does it for somebody that doesn't look like you and y'all in the same group? If you could do it for yourself, and your girlfriends can do it for each other. Why is it this guy's responsibility to do it for his group of women in particular? When when you're doing it, if if you do it, and when you're doing it, you're doing it for women as a collective. Now, the reason I keep bringing a collective thing is this. If these women are your sisters, and y'all all clicked up, why are you mad if your sister dates your brother? Y'all sisters, right? It's a sisterhood. So, you can't hook your sister up with your brother? Or does your sister hook you up with her brother? See, it's funny to me that everybody wants to have it both ways and, and, and make other people toe the line. And the weird part about that is you expect these people to toe the line because you said so. If you're taking on somebody's ideology that they gave to you and your men have an ideology and you won't take, take, take to that, then obviously you are, uh, uh, um, you have chosen who you will be with. So if you're in the feminist feminism or you're a feminist, you've already chosen the side of feminism. Woman first. Now here's the thing about why I'm at saying that. If it's about being a woman first and your interest is about your interest as a woman, well, if this guy's about his interest as a man, and you and his interests don't match, and he and he winds up matching with another sister in a sisterhood. What's the problem? So he's he, he was supposed to get with him, and he's supposed to be woman first. But the other sisters in the sisterhood know that, you know, you can't get involved with a man and be woman first. Like it's it's got to be some type of teamwork or, or reciprocal type of uh, relationship. So, if, but if you can reciprocate the women of other races, and you can't reciprocate to the men in your own group, and these and these women actually reciprocate to the men in your race, that means you know you know how to reciprocate in a relationship when it comes to other women. But you, but you, and your counterparts know how to reciprocate when it comes to, in a relationship when it comes to men. 
So you reciprocate to the women. They reciprocate to the men. You just don't reciprocate to the men. So is it equal? Because they, they obviously want to work with the guys. You don't. So if you chose feminism, is it, isn't that equal to interracial relationships? Because you chose a, a, a inter, you, you, should, you chose an interracial clique. So why be mad about interracial dating? Um, like, share, subscribe. We out. Gotta go. Peace.